We've reported often on this show about serious and sometimes fatal patient injuries associated with magnetic resonance procedures. We've talked in the past about burns from electrodes and cables during MRI exams, about injuries in patients who have implanted neurological stimulators, about burns in patients wearing transdermal patches, and about metallic objects brought into the MR unit that have flown across the room and killed people. Unfortunately, this problem has not gone away. MR-associated accidents, many of them life-threatening or fatal, are still occurring, and this has caused continued concern in the radiology community. In order to help reduce the risk, the American College of Radiology, or ACR, has issued a comprehensive update to its 2004 white paper on MR safety. It's called the ACR Guidance Document for Safe MR Practices, and it covers every aspect of MR safety from the design of the MR suite and the qualifications of personnel to screening patients and what to do in an emergency. If you work in or near a magnetic resonance facility, it's important to have and read this document. But it also contains information that may be useful for non-radiology personnel who prepare patients for MR procedures, for example, on managing the potential risks of aneurysm clips, pacemakers, dermal drug delivery patches, and gadolinium-based contrast agents.